Good morning students. I hope you all are fine. Today we are going to read a story Gopal and the Helsa fish. I hope you all will enjoy. So let's go ahead with the story. It was the season for Helsa fish. The fisherman got a lot of them. They could think of nothing beyond it. The fish were sold in the market. The fish market was overcrowded. Everyone wanted to buy the Helsa fish and nothing else. Everyone could talk of nothing but Helsa fish. And the fishmongers lured their customers by saying that the price of Helsa fish had come down. In the palace also, the courtiers discussed the matter. A courtier showed the king a big Helsa fish he had caught. The king got angry to see the courtiers who were talking about Helsa fish in the court. The king lost his temper. The courtiers became silent and sad. Then the king felt guilty. He realized his mistake. He also realized that it was the season of Helsa fish. Then he told that even Gopal couldn't stop anyone from talking about the Helsa fish. Gopal was one of the clever courtiers of king's court. Gopal protested. He said that he could not stop them from talking about Helsa fish. Gopal protested. He said that he could stop them from talking about the Helsa fish. Dear students, we will end the story here. We will continue the story ahead in next session. But before that, we are going to check how much you have learned. So here are some questions for you. Question number one. Why did the king want no more? Why did the king want no more talk about the Helsa fish? And the options for you are the king got fed up with the discussion about Helsa fish. Next, the king did not like Helsa fish. Next, the courtiers became mad for Helsa fish. And next, the king wanted to discuss an important matter. And the answer for you is the king got fed up with the discussion about Helsa fish. Next question is how can you say that it was the season of Helsa fish? And the options for you are number one, fishermen were selling Helsa fish at a low price. Option number two, all the men, including the courtiers, talked about the Helsa fish. Option number three, the fishmongers sold nothing but Helsa fish. And option number four, all of the above. And the right option for you is all of the above. Your next question is, your next question is, how did the fishermen lure the customers to buy Helsa fish? And the options for you are, by saying that the price of the Helsa fish had come down. Option number two, the fishermen caught a lot of them. Option number three, by saying that they had nothing but Helsa. Option number four, all of the above. And the right option for you is by saying that the price of the Helsa fish had come down. Your next question is what was difficult? What was difficult for anyone during this season? And the options for you are to catch the Helsa fish. Option number two to stop to sell Helsa fish. Option number three to stop oneself to buy the Helsa fish. And option number four, to stop talking about the Helsa fish. And the right option for you is to stop talking about the Helsa fish. Now, it's a practice time. You'll be given some questions to answer. And you have to write the answers for that. The question number one is, why did the king lose his temper? And question number two, who was Gopal and what did the king ask him? So these are the two questions for you for which you have to write the answer. That's the end of this session and we will meet again in the next session. Thank you.